Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. So I thought this would be the perfect time to share with you guys some of my top comfy basic essentials from Aritzia. And I know a lot of people think that Aritzia pieces are pretty pricey, so I do want to help some of you guys out and share the pieces that I think are actually worth the money. And these pieces will focus more on basic t-shirts, leggings, sweatpants, bralettes, that kind of thing. For tops, we'll start off with the bralettes. So I'm actually already wearing the first comfy basic essential. This one is called the Tiny Rib Cage Tank and it's from the Wilfred Freeline. I will say that this does run very small. I believe this is a 2XS and I made a mistake and I should have gotten this in an extra small um, because it is quite tight on me, but nevertheless, it is still comfortable. And I also want to show you guys this bralette as well and I will try it on after this. And what I love about both of these bralettes is that they're both not only great for lounging around in, but they also go great with a ton of other clothing options. So here are some of the blazer options. So the tiny ribcage tank goes really well with, with other neutral blazers. I think it goes really well with cream colored ones. And I love it with dark gray oversized blazers. And then we have these cardigans. And this is what the second bralette looks like. This is the Tallulah Seamless Bra Top. I've also worn both of these bralettes in a ton of my Instagram reels. And here's what it looks like with some of the same blazers, sweaters, and cardigans. Okay, so on to the tank tops. So there are two different tank tops that I highly recommend, and this is the first one. This is the TNA 90s Corellas tank top, and I got it in two colors. And I'll go a little closer here to show you guys some of the details. And I do think they're super flattering. I do own a few from other brands, but I always just end up wearing these. And both of these tank tops are double XS, and I love wearing these with like basic sweatpants like these or um, these other other pair of sweatpants from Aritzia that I will show later on in this video. So these tank tops aren't super, super thin, but I do recommend wearing a bra for extra coverage. Just a heads up, if any of you are interested in getting this in the white color, you definitely do need a bra for that one. Um, I ended up returning it actually and um, just switching it with a different color. My next favorite tank top is this TNA Chill Bergman tank and I got it in this camel color as well as white. Super comfortable. The previous tank top was more cropped. This one hits right on the waist. I do think these tank tops are great for summertime. For those who prefer thicker straps, this tank top is for you. I think this is the perfect thickness. And here is the white one. And this tank top is in a 2XS. So I do think both of these tank tops are staples, especially if you want a thin strap one and a thicker strap one. On to t-shirts. These have become my favorite t-shirts ever. This is the Tea and Action Foundation Quo t-shirt and I got two of them because I just love them so much. This is probably the softest t-shirt that I've ever worn. Um, I'm actually gonna check out what this t-shirt is made of just because I'm actually curious. And so it says it's 46% Pima cotton, 46% tensile, modal, and 8% elastane. These t-shirts are perfect for the gym because they are super lightweight and I do sweat quite a lot. So far, I've only seen these in black and white, but once they come out with other colors, you already know I am getting more. Next up, we have the TNA Home Stretch Crew t-shirt. I believe there are different lengths of this top and I decided to get the hip one. I think I've gone through a really, really long phase of just buying only crop tops. Um, and I'm now finally at the point where I'm getting older and I'm slowly realizing that I need more tops that aren't cropped. So um, I went ahead and got a bunch of tops, obviously from Maritzia, that cover my stomach. But yeah, that's where I am currently at in life. This top was one of my favorite t-shirts to wear uh, whenever I did some errands. And as you can see, it is a ribbed top. And I've been pairing this top a lot with other Aritzia bottoms, mainly their flare leggings, which are some of the bottoms that are featured later on this video so if you do have your eye on these definitely get them next up we have a very popular item and it is the Babaton contour crew t-shirt and in terms of sizing this is very important to note if you do choose to purchase anything from their contour line I do recommend sizing up and here's what the darker brown one looks like both of these contour t-shirts are an XS even though these still fit me really well I do think I feel more comfortable in a small so I got these in two different cuts and different colors. These shirts are by far the most 
expensive ones. Not only are they super flattering, but the material does actually feel like a second skin, if you know what I mean. Aritzia does claim that it feels like a second skin on the website. And as you can see, the material, it's so, so smooth and it does give a nice polished finish to any of your outfits. So if you do want to dress up a look a little more, then these t-shirts are definitely for you. So we're finally on to long sleeves. So this long sleeve is also from their Contra line. I am obsessed with this color. It's not just the dark brown, it's like a burgundy kind of like maroon brown. What I love about the Contra line so far is how easy it is to dress them up and down. But yeah, this one is an extra small, but I should have gotten the small. So this is the next long sleeve. This is the TNA Thermal Scoop Neck, and I got it in two different colors. So this is the light brown one, and then I got it in this like sage green color. I remember getting this specifically for cold weather and I'm currently filming this video in a very cold room. Once I put this on, I was immediately warm. In fact, I am sweating a little bit actually. They're great to wear underneath any coats and jackets and I love the waffle knit design here and these are cropped. I'm not sure if they have made different lengths of this top. For the next long sleeve, this is the TNA Home Stretch Crew long sleeve. So this is pretty much the same as as the TNA Home Stretch Crew t-shirt, but just in a long sleeve form. As you can see, I obviously love gray, and I also got it in this white color, but the length is slightly cropped. So just like a t-shirt, these two have been my go-to long sleeves for colder weather. So pretty much all the tops that I've shown you guys fit into three categories. They are all comfortable, durable, and flattering. So whenever I shop for clothes, I look for those three key things. I know some of you may not find flattering as important as comfortable and durability, but I do just because whenever I like the way certain clothes fit my body, it does make me feel more confident. So I do think that's a very important category. So we're finally down to sweaters. I loved this particular sweater so much that I got them in three different colors. My top to trait is being obsessed with one thing and buying it in every possible color you can imagine. So let's start off with the dark colored one. So I obviously got these sweaters during my cropped top phase so all of them are cropped i do want to get a regular cut hoodie from aritzia soon but i still really love these sweaters i know a lot of retail stores carry crop hoodies like this for some reason a lot of them can't do the cut right i can't really explain it a lot of other crop sweaters that i see from different stores they're either too boxy or they're structured in a way where it doesn't really look flattering this one is very flattering for a sweater and i featured these sweaters in my airport outfit inspo video, which I will link in the description box below if you guys are interested in seeing that. And if you are on a limited budget, I would recommend getting a darker colored one just because white is a super risky color to get um, just because it gets dirty really easily. I haven't worn this particular color out um, that much just because I was scared of getting it dirty. If you wanna avoid that scenario, I would just go ahead and get the darker colored one. So this color um, or the black one, dark gray, whatever color they have, um, I just go for those. We finally made it to the bottoms. I believe this is a pretty popular piece. This is a TNA Butter High Rise Atmosphere Short, and these are five inches. I remember reading reviews of these shorts online before buying them, and there were a lot of people arguing that this is a dupe for Lululemon's Align Short, and they were saying that the material is very, very similar, and the price difference between the Lululemon shorts and these ones are about $20 to $30. So it's not a huge, huge gap, but it does make a difference if you are on a budget. So as someone who actually has both of them, and if I'm being honest, I do prefer the Lululemon shorts, but these are still very, very great high quality shorts. I do think that this length is perfect for me. I find that the three inch shorts are a little too short, especially if you are someone who is going to squat a lot of the gym. You don't don't really want shorts that will ride up and one of the reasons why I do prefer the Lululemon shorts is because I feel like the stitching on these shorts aren't as good as the Lululemon ones. Like, there is some loose stitching at the bottom here but it's not too too bad um, so I am still gonna recommend getting these shorts just because they are still very comfortable, 
flattering and they're still great for the gym. Next up, we have the TNA Chill Atmosphere High Rise 3 inch short. Unlike the last pair of shorts, these are a lot shorter. So the green TNA Butter Shorts I actually got not that long ago, but these ones I've had for a couple of years now. And at the time, I didn't know which length of short was right for me. So I got the super short ones for some reason. I have worn them quite a bit for lounging and I actually don't regret buying these at all. They're very, very comfortable. If you guys don't mind this length, then this one's for you, but I would recommend a longer length. And they're just perfect to wear to lounge around in the house, especially during the summertime. Now onto leggings. I've probably worn these next few leggings over a thousand times, especially these high-rise flare leggings. The first one is the TNA Chill Atmosphere Flare High-Rise Legging, and I got these in the black and gray colors. These have become my go-to leggings when it comes to doing any type of errands. The material is very breathable and thin, so these pants are perfect for warmer weather. Just like the Aritzia tops, these flare leggings are super, super comfortable and flattering, and they literally look good in any type of casual top. And these leggings come in different size lengths. There's a regular length, a short length, and a tall length. Obviously, I got the short ones because I am 5'2". Now, these may look very similar to the last leggings, but this is actually the TNA Flow Atmosphere High Rise Flare Legging. And I also featured this and the other leggings in my airport outfit inspo as well. So you can tell how much I love these leggings. I remember going off about how much I loved these particular leggings in my previous video on my VK outfit inspo. So again, flattering, comfortable, durable. And there's two key differences between these leggings and the other TNA Atmosphere ones. The first is that this material is way thicker. So I tend to wear the other leggings for warmer weather and then these ones for colder weather and there's definitely a bigger price difference between the two. I believe the other TNA Atmosphere leggings were around like $25 or so and the regular price of these I think are like $70 to $80 but I did get them on sale for $30 which is a huge huge difference. So if you have been eyeing these pair of leggings for the past few months and you see them at a decent price please run and go get these. Next key difference is that the other leggings are more suitable for casual tops but this pair is not only great for casual tops but they also work very well with dressier tops so for example i have this tuscany sweater also from aritzia which i will definitely feature in another video i would consider this top dressier you know wearing this with this top would still look really well so i think that's all for leggings last pair of bottoms that i do want to show you guys are the tna cozy af mega sweatpants yes i said cozy af that's what it's called. And I've tried on many sweatpants in my life and these are by far one of my favorites. It's super thick, so it's perfect for like winter and fall. It's also adjustable. There's a string right here that you can use to make it tighter. And just like their sweaters, it's a baggy fit, but still flattering. So far, I only have one color, but I am looking into getting either a black, dark gray, or maybe even like a beige khaki colored one. This actually concludes the video. This was a lot of clothes but I honestly think these are some of the best basic comfy casual pieces from Aritzia and I will link each of these pieces down below so if you enjoyed this video or found this video helpful please give this video a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe for more content and I'll see you in the next video